We all get the same questions over and over again in our Instagram DM box, so let's save ourselves a little time. Instagram allows us to do quick replies or saved replies, which means that we can type something once and then use a keyword to trigger that and send it to the potential clients who are asking us the same questions over and over to save our fingers from having to type it out every single time. So let's take a look at how to do that. Inside of your direct message inbox, all you have to do is go into one of your messages. Doesn't matter which one, we're just setting up those quick replies. So you're gonna go into your DMs, you're gonna pick on one of those things, and then you're gonna look at that little black circle with the plus sign in it, you're gonna go ahead and tap that. That's gonna pop up some features, and you're gonna grab the little word bubble with the three dots inside of it. Here is where you have those saved replies. Now, to create these, all you have to do is click that little plus sign, and then you're gonna type in your shortcut. This is going to be a one word thing that you can just type into the response button when people email you or send you the same thing over and over again, and that's going to trigger it. So I recommend this is something that is the first word that you're gonna put in there. So whatever you're doing, that's the first word that you're typing. So it won't trigger it while it's in the body of another text. So don't worry about it if it's somewhat common, but I do recommend so that you remember it, you form kind of a long weird word. So I would maybe put two words together as one word and use that as your trigger word for this. So you're going to type in the shortcut. So let's say test one for mine. And then we're going to type in our message. This is where we put the message. And you're going to include your emojis if you need to. If you're going to include links, this is the place to do it. You can space them out so that there are lines in between. Whatever you have to do to have that really good fleshed out thought out response, which people then think is going to be customized to them. And of course, once you actually put this in, you can go in and change things. So even if it's going to be a little different for each person, you can form the body of your text and then just go in and tweak it before you send it. It's going to auto-populate it for you. So at that point, you're going to save that and it's going to go over to your, there we go, it's going to go over to your saved replies. So at that point, you're just going to be able to click it and it's going to pop up. You can see how it auto-populated that right there for me and then I can just change it if I need to and then I can go ahead and sip, hit the send button and I am good to go. Now when you're using these quick replies, you want to make sure you're fleshing this out as best as possible. So pick your five top things that you get asked and create five replies for that. You can then build on that later on if you need to, but have those five basic things that you want to send to people. These are great for sending out your freebies. So if you have a lead magnet, go ahead and list these out so that you can then send them to people and tweak it if you need to. This also helps if you're sending out links to people because sometimes you don't remember links. For example, if I as an author were going to be giving out my link to a book that someone won in a contest, I want to have that auto populated there because I don't want to have to go look for it and that's not something I have memorized every single time they ask for the exact same book for my collection. So now I have that programmed in and I can just hit that title with that little keyword that I created and send that out to them even if I am out the door and on my way after they have won it after one of my live streams. Let me know down in the comments, how are you going to be using these quick replies in your business? And make sure you hit the subscribe bell because we're going to continue to talk about how you can be growing your business profitably through your work on Instagram and all social media to create that profitable business through your smart social media marketing. I'll see you in the next video.